Oh boy, what's the whole thing? This one is in all caps. As the guillotine slides toward my neck, I produce a tiny barbell I've been hiding in my mouth and lift it with my tongue. <laughs> one last rep. <laughs> There, this is it. Is Wario a libertarian? The greatest threat in the history of forums, locked by a moderator after 12,239 pages of speech. What was the other one? What happens when Kirby swallows the Koran and is granted its considerable power? <laughs> Read my 400 page handbook. Oh, wait, I know Brendan can this. Though, yeah, I mean, but that thing where the longest piece of human literature yep. in existence. It's a Super Smash Brothers thing. Currently, actually, like, yeah. I call every four-legged animal I see a dog, and I am correct more often than not, so I will never stop. This one is really recent. It's 12 days ago. I am selling six beautiful, extremely uh, ill white horses. They no longer recognize me as their father and are the burden of my life. <laughs> Something on your mind? Gosh, Sean, I didn't want to talk oh, to you, Alistair. No, you gotta have a heart to heart with Alistair, man. Not in the middle of us getting revenge. That is the We're, best time to have a heart to heart yeah. with someone. Come on, you have time. The game's not gonna penalize you. We still have to love Alistair. Don't you want to get as much personal information as, as, out of everyone as possible? We already got all Isn't we can get out. Isn't that how we play games? So, we already got all we can get out of Alistair in these situations. Bring me your dead pet, and I will make a sword out of it for thirty-nine dollars. No. I've never read that one. Hold well, on, uh, let's see what hard we can have with Gwen in this situation. Yeah, we haven't really talked to Gwen. Is there something you need? I will answer to the best of my ability. Yeah, what's that? I would be lying if I said it was easy. First, there were rules, and we were constantly watched to make sure we behaved appropriately. Alright, this is how many just are treating you. We have to cast the spells to just the so control the effects completely. A single word spoken incorrectly, a gesture out of sync, and lack of focus. And we needed to have perfect focus, or we would be in danger. That sounds great. Danger from what is a good... From fade spirits. If we were careless, they would enter our minds, and we would become abominations. Without the circle and my mentors, I would not have been where I am today. And there was joy in life with the circle. The joy is a fellowship in knowing that you are not in love with yourselves. In spite of everything, I was happy in the tower, and I loved it. Neat. I can't tell, like, is Wynn very old, or is just, like, relatively old with white hair? I say... She looks like she's in her 40s, but her hair was only late 50s, early 60s. I would say mid 50s. Mm -hmm. I love her helmet. You mean the stupid yeah. Nate chat? Yeah, Nate like, chats are so. Who designed that? I thought that's good. Looks like a supergirl from the 40s. That's a thing I want to put on my character. Alistair looks like she's a believer. To be I fair, think... we stuck Alistair in Templar armor. Morgan got the worst of it. You mean? She's got the dumb hat. Well, she right now, has the dumb default outfit. We gave her the tacky, better outfit. Shale is really stunning on all of us. Like, yeah, well, he's just got his rocks. I guess Shale really rocks it. What's Drill's most beautiful recent How often does he? Like, a couple times a day, every day. Hashtag above cowards. He tweets, but like he interacts with people a lot. Really? Yeah, he's constantly tweeting at people. Crap, we were all poisoned. Better wait. And I better rebuff myself. Sometimes you just post pictures that don't make any sense. Oh, this one is actually really like coherent. Can't wait until work is over so I can stop sitting in front of this monitor and sit in front of the monitor at home, which is three inches bigger. <laughs> I always had this sort of parallel between Wint and Critical. 
Really? You know, yeah. Indonesian pirates raid my yacht and find me on the floor to take a fireball. Corrupt that spider. Corrupt? Yeah, it's a corrupted spider. Yeah. The tape has a way of getting to everything. Crap, crap, crap! Now, Stu, when do you get your spider powers? Yeah, that'd be a cool game. Like when you get these spider -Man. I would love a game that, like, just kind of surprises you by changing genres. Like, it's a fantasy game, but you do get powers in the same way that old-fashioned superheroes do. Complete. I don't think I'm going to. I'm a dwarf. Maybe in the next one. Maybe in the fourth one, since the next one's pretty much ready to ship. You never know. I mean... It could get another month delay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Actually, no, another month delay would put it out right in winter break, which would be convenient for me. If they decided to add something now, they'd have to completely scrap the game and start over. Well, they tacked on a multiplayer again. The multiplayer is different. That's like outside of the oh, game. Oh, you mean add a new feature to the main game? Yeah. <clears throat> Hey, Brittany. Oh, yeah. Do you want to see a layer that adds it to even be more personal? Obviously. Obviously. Alright, flashbacks like, I don't like, to the bad. Like fantasy games that are full of like tactics and high talk and power kings. Like, those are cool. But they always just struck me as like political power fantasies. And I'm not, I can't relate to that. I can't enjoy that. It has to be how the fantasy affects the people living in the world on a personal day to day basis. That's, that's what I'm doing. Do you see those weapons in the over? No. Was it the kings? Or... Yep. Oh, this is the one that killed him? That's the ogre. Yeah, yeah go beat him up. <laughs> Holy crap, I get still stunned with that ability? I gotta go behind him, just hammer his butt. That's what Shale's doing. This is what Shale did. I don't think you heard the second part. Oh. Yes, I did. Genlock Necromancer. Raise yourself, dead. That's the thumbs in the crowd. Alright, we have all of Kaden's armor. I've never actually played Dungeons and Dragons, but I feel like it would be a lot more fun than. It's a lot of fun when you play it with like people you're close to because you can control the game basically and make it as fun as you want. Yeah. yeah. But if it's just like. Like if you ask something silly and your the game man master or whatever allows it, you'll have the best time. Right? You do. I'm sorry, you. Remember that one? I said. My favorite, like. It would not be the first time I woke to a younger man in my day. How old will women this evil and conniving when they grow old? What? That's just really me, strong idea. language. Just like, me. oh, see, I have sex with younger men. You're evil and conniving. That, that's really to be really fair. Far the way tone to go wasn't out. that bad. We really? got Duncan's sword of death. Yay! So Which we're gonna we, put on to Zephyr. What do we do now? We walk back. Now we save but, the uh, world. We're yeah. already on our way to doing this. You know those posts that like are like you know Dungeons and Dragons moments that are like funny. My favorite one was like I accidentally I accidentally gave uh, like gave an orc a hand job <laughs> or whatever because they tried to rip his stick off but they rolled too low <laughs> so he just wound up like because stuff like that can happen if whatever I still think one of my favorites is tries to seduce the guard what was a d twenty dungeon master size heavily Alistair God. Oh, Oh, like, the best ones are like when the dungeon brought. masters like, we need to do something. are upset about what's going on. Right, oh. you give him a pyro? Oh. A pyre is respectful. I like him. And everyone, yeah. He was a good man who hoped too much and died. Man, he had, a, he had a really he had a wife. He deserved what little honor we can afford to grant him. He didn't have any kids. Yeah, but her wife loved him. Yeah, she just has an insane dad. Mm. 
All right. Logan was his father-in-law. Yeah. Finally, something. This game is like a lack of substance. What's me? I don't mean that at all. Look at his beard going into his armor. <laughs> hey! We made up for Alistair chewing us out at the last section. That was a buddy. Can I actually put on any of the loot I got? Wouldn't that be disrespectful? I don't think he's gonna care. I can. Oh, I can actually put it on. Do yeah, what? No, I like putting out the store in Caden's gear though. Do it. Oh yeah, that's kind of cool. I can't yet. Oh. What? Ah. I would keep it on me. Wait, since were Alistair and Kaylin? They are technically half brothers. Oh, okay, I don't know if they're cousins or half brothers. But Kaylin didn't know. Right? Yeah. Only Alistair. That's weird. Yeah. That's weird that he considered Goldana like his only family, but he didn't consider Kaylin his family. Probably because of what would be realistic that in like she's Goldana's she's actually a lot. Yeah, because I feel like. He knew Kaylin, and he knew there was never a chance of them actually legitimately understanding that they were brothers. <coughs> so he would fantasize about Goldana because she wasn't, like, real to him. She was more of a concept of, wow, the sister that I could possibly have a sisterly relationship with. While he already knew Kaylin, and he already knew it was, like, a leader-subordinate relationship, and nothing yeah. else would come of it. So he could fantasize about Goldana, and then, like, be realistic with Kaylin. Mm -hmm. yeah. They're both half-siblings. Alright. Cash on it. Or maybe his because she was a child of his mother and his mother was more important than his father. Yeah. That's all. Either or it would fit. The Nug Crusher? Yep. The Nug Crusher? There is a dwarven speed so animal called a Nug. Oh. I'm thinking of like... Yes, which is why I... <laughs> Your face looks way better. Is there armor that matches that? I really like that. I, like I that. don't think so. There should be armor. You can't just put a pink helmet on. There's like a lack of purple, I feel like. In... Is purple a royal color here? Oh, we met yeah. that girl. We met that girl from... Um, Wasn't she from like a different country or something? She was from... She was like French. Ah! What's it called? What's it called? Orlay. Orlay. And she was wearing purple and pink. And she was like, yeah, everyone She's here stylish. is so bland. Because Orlay, the fashion is more colorful, and here they're more, hey, we're literally Giraffe. dying, we don't have time to think about colors. Well, she looked she look like a pretty flower. Even, um, good. even Liliana looks a little, dresses a little nicer. Uh, I need to go like here so I can cycle through the party. Is Liliana still here? Yeah. I've seen her. Well, we, we don't use her. Yeah, we fill the road niche. You only need run and road. <laughs> oh! Right! Evil trees. <laughs> the best kind of trees. The poet trees. We hope that, that one tree find its head. I really hope when it not grows it reacts, oh gee, I'm a tree. No, it's to save the rainforest. I love, it's like... easier to do when the rainforest isn't trying to kill us. What do you love there? Like, um... Anthropomorphic... Well, not anthropomorphic, but, like, evil, like, living trees. Yes. Like, that's, like... If I can get behind one fantasy concept... It started with Lord of the Rings, and then from there I just... They're so... It's so bizarre. They such the potential to be so elegant. Yeah. And it's bizarre, yeah, it's great. I love any, like, living forest idea, like the flowers are fairies. Yeah. The trees are these great, tall guardians. There's so much wisdom. Yes. 